How are you, sweetie? Come here. Hi, sweetie. There are definitely perks when your mom owns a bakery. You're welcome. <laughs> Vilma Yoas knows this well. My parents had the business before they had me. This oven was delivered on the day I was born. Since 1967, Dutch Epicure in Litchfield has been luring locals to indulge in traditional Dutch delicacies and cheeses. The very specific pastries that our customers come looking for, and this is really the only place that they can find them. I'd like to thank Vilma for my physique. <laughs> this place is just, oh man. Uh, she, she could make it a, a, you know, a, a Yule log at Christmas that I would marry if I could. <laughs> the woman is just spectacular. The place is iconic. Yoaz became a chef after graduating from Boston College, but the bakery she knows best called her home. I find that the big products from Holland and, and from Europe are a little bit less sweet than you would find in America. Like they're, they're more of a, a sandy, um, biscuity kind of a cookie rather than, than moist and chewy. We have the bitter cookies that we make, which are uh, almond macaroon, um, down to these uh, spigolatsias, which are a, a shortbread but with ginger spices in them. In between ringing up customers, Vilma's mom, Betsy Yoaz, who's helping out today, offers some pronunciation pointers. Medium Gouda? Medium Howda. Howda. Yeah. Looking around, we wonder what else we should know. Dutch, I think, is unusual. You have the in the back of your throat. Now, this is an easy one. Stroopwafels. Stroopwafels. Yes, stroop actually means syrup. And those are designed to be put on top of your coffee cup. The syrup inside will get nice and warm, and then you'll have a nice warm cookie. That's brilliant. Dark chocolate sprinkles. Achelslach. Uh, so I would be happy to repeat that, but I'm afraid I would get something on <laughs> your face. Wait, stand back. <laughs> Hachelslach. Very good. Yes. You're my one of us now. My work here is done. <laughs> Can I help somebody? <laughs> <laughs> The bakery has shortened its hours due to the pandemic. They are open Wednesday through Friday from 9 to 3 and a few hours on the weekend. That is Chronicle for tonight. Thank you so much for joining us. Have a wonderful weekend. We'll see you back here on Monday night. Good night, everyone.